Welcome to Kemi Talks Gist. It's the 1st of March, 2020. Happy New Month. Well, this is the latest on DeVito, okay? Well, remember a few weeks ago, DeVito said, it's time I need a new plane. And I said, no, you don't. Your father's buying a new plane. And when he pays for it, it's going to come out. It's a Gulf Stream, 19-seater, whatever. David was like, what's that woman eating? What does she drink? I want what she's taking. I'm inside your house. David, I live in the Adelaide case. I know everything going on. Okay, so when I got the receipt to the Gulf Stream, yeah, the receipt. I have the receipt to Davido's father's plane. I said, oh, wow, he paid it all off. So I tweeted it and told people that it's not Davido's jet, it's his father's, and it's a Gulf Stream and blah, blah, blah. So now he goes like, oh, my baby's here. Our baby's here. Because his father was at the cockpit, and he looked stupid because I told people it's not his jet. Hey, OBO, stop lying. Stop showing off. I know everything going on. The receipt to that jet is inside my thing here, my desk. Meanwhile, Godwin and Mephile, the central bank governor, shaded DJ Adeliki. When he was at Ibejuleki inspecting Dangote's refinery the other day, he said, hmm, anyone that defaults on CBN loans, we're going to start seizing their private jets. So they can ride on bicycles. They're flying jets up and down. They still owe CBN money. Only God knows what's going on over there. But in Mephile is like, mm, who's he shading now? You can't borrow money from the CBN unless you are big. Big. Did I say he went to Dangote's refinery and he was inspecting the place? So people that have refineries, petrochemical plants, ah, Pacific Energy, that one belongs to Davido's father. So was he shading Davido's father? We'll seize your private jets. Just Google that. We'll seize your private jets. When you put entertainment and gist with investigative journalism, you get Kemi Talks Gist. Don't forget to follow me, youtube.com slash Kemi Talks Gist. And yeah, Davido, didn't I tell you, don't fly any private jets for six months and make sure not everybody gets in there, your crew and all, before you know we corona on the seats. Oh, well, I'll see you next time.